Well, Territory is a really big place. The distance and isolation has been a big motivator for driving innovation. Working out in the remote regions, I saw firsthand what happens to people when they're living in complete energy poverty. It's important with a startup that you look at how you can benefit society and how you can help the community around you. We don't mind getting in and giving it a go, trying to solve a problem that other people already think is solved if we know we have a better solution. Innovation, I think, comes in so many different shapes and forms. Innovation for me is creative when you've got your back to the wall. Anthony and I had multiple ideas before we started Moby. And you've got no option but to succeed. But ultimately, it's just a desire to try and make things a little bit better. No, I never thought of myself as an innovator. I still kind of don't. No, I see myself as an electrician. I'm Sparky, who created a business. I saw ourselves as people that saw a gap in a market and wanted to try to solve a problem. I've always loved making things, and going into a field that involves innovation means I'm completely free to express myself. Initially, when we first started Moby, it was to try to solve the method to transport yourself to work or to universities. I found that there was a lot of cars on the road with just one person in them, and I thought, well, what if we can create something helping cars off the road? We do video consultations for people's pets that live regional and remote or, or find it difficult to get their pet into the vet clinic. Trying to help people's pets was what I've always been trying to do. So at DICE we have an innovative approach to business. We've been very fortunate to deliver solar and storage and also Wi-Fi into remote regions. The difference that it's had out there literally has been life-changing. My company has created a new technology for very high-speed metal 3D printing. So what we're trying to do is change the way that the human race builds metal parts. I love to read the forums, I love TED Talks. I get really excited about what the future for digital health can be. Anthony and I jump in the car together and drive around Darwin just talking. Just having someone there and believes in the concept as much as you do, it, that really helps. My inspiration now comes from my kids. They are the drive for me to create a sustainable future. So that our children can look forward to the same kind of advantages that we have. I think we need innovation here because we have so many challenges from being so far away from everywhere else. The Northern Territory, just naturally, people are very helpful with each other. I love the, the atmosphere, I love the lifestyle and the ability to be creative. To be able to develop a concept and make people feel comfortable to actually use it is one of the main challenges. You build it and then you have to refine it. If you fail, don't see it as a failure. Persistence is key. And then go for it. Be creative and solve the problem in a way that nobody else has, in a way that's better.